if you do, I want to go by this here boy, Ari. We're back with another reaction video. Today we have uh, my new favorite, uh, what's what, animator? Yeah, animator on YouTube. You guys know previously it was Young Don, the Sauce God, but I don't know. I just feel like. I just I, I I don't know I don't know I just I just I just started you know I started like yo yo videos more Cause when I when I came across him I came across yo yo when he was like at I wanna say sixty no I wanna say thirty I I can't I can't remember but all I know he didn't have a hundred thousand he sure damn sure didn't have five hundred thousand I can tell you that much he didn't have that much as that when I discovered him he no he didn't even have a hundred thousand that's for sure. He didn't have 100,000 subscribers. I remember him celebrating 100,000 subscribers. But, yeah. Um, yeah, we're going to be reacting to his video. Say, confessing my, my embarrassing else. Boy, this man get hot. But before we get into the video, let me take a little sip of water. Let's get into it. That shit ain't So, about a right. I watched the video that a YouTube animator posted, and this is an animator that I adore. No. Idolize. No. Worship. I mean, this person is like superior to everyone, and that person is Yo Yo 808. And then I watched a Swoozie video afterwards. <laughs> nah, but in that video that Swoozie posted, he talked about some L's that he's taken in his life, and at the end, tagged some creators to make the same video. Um, I've like watched this video before. In the L's. So I'm gonna tag some people. I'm gonna tag Alex Clark, Lord DIY. Let's tag Yo Yo 808. Since Swoozie asked me, I will confess some L's that I've experienced in my life. Mm -hmm. So one day I'm working out, and this was during early COVID, so all the gyms were closed, and I was using a garage. This is actually the same garage that I brought that one girl to. He was trying to get his freak on. But before I start my workout, I peep that it's raining, so the leak in the ceiling caused a puddle to be in the middle of the floor. And I'm wearing slides and socks, so me not wanting to get anything wet, unlike the last time I was in the garage. <laughs> I put a yoga mat over the puddle and go on about my business. So I begin my exercise, get a few reps in, and start pacing back and forth, hyping myself up for the next set. And adrenaline is up, bro. I got high energy music in my ears, enough caffeine to kill a baby elephant in my bloodstream. I'm about to kill it. On my walk back to the weights, I step on that mat to get to the bench. Zero traction, bro. I have never gone from standing vertical to being horizontal and five feet above the ground that quickly in my life, bro. It was painful, but the worst part was my body flung so violently from stepping on that mat that my phone flew out of my hand. That almost definitely broke. Oh. Speaking of broke, the next story takes place around the time I had just started my channel. I didn't have a job yet and I was still living in my mom's place and her not being too keen on my decision to not go to college, live in her house rent free, eat all of her food, so I can pursue drawing pictures on the internet. She took my phone. Now anyone knows to do this live off the internet stuff, you need to have a phone. So I go to one of my homies. Yo, Ben. And I'm like, bro, Bill Gates is single now? Ben. How, bro, how are you the CEO of Microsoft and you can't keep your girl? Like, I guess the company name fits. Like, bro, ben. Hey, I got a question for the ladies. I got a question. Let the, this is for the woman. How do you keep a woman happy? How do you keep a woman happy? Obviously, the two richest men in the world. The two richest men, Bill Gates and Jeff Bezos, both got divorced. Money in the problem. See, that's the problem, bro. I, w I just want to know, how do you make a woman happy? You can't make a happy broke not, I can't even say broke. You can't make you. You can't make a happy break. You can't be break. It's one thing to have your little hustle going on to get yourself some money, but to be break, I don't want you. No homo. No homo. No homo. I don't want no break friends around me, bro. That's a burden. You can't even just do some spontaneous. Hey, let's go for lunch. Oh man. Oh, budget type. You can't find ten dollars to. You know what? Forget. Let me buy you lunch. All right, you got me next time. All right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next time, come. What? What? The ten dollars up there? What the hell? You keep on scratching your head, look up in the ceiling for? Man, yo, yo, what's good, dog? Bro, you have like three phones, right? Can, can I borrow one? My mom took mine, and you know, I need to 
from my channel. Uh, yeah, that's cool. This one is old, so it has some problems, but you can you can have it. So my friend Ben, who for some reason always has like two or three phones on him, lets me use one of his old phones. So fast forward after that school year, I'm still using the phone, and I'm in Columbia, South Carolina, visiting my grandma's house. It's like 3 a.m., and I'm doing what all teenage boys do at 3 a.m., making YouTube videos. And then I start watching the So I'm watching this one video, but then the screen what? freezes, but the audio keeps playing. So I'm trying to figure out how to fix it, but then my Bluetooth headphones disconnected. I had my volume all the way up, so I start panicking. At this point, I'm pressing hella buttons, I'm touching the screen. Try yo, yo, your shit? Come on, imagine. We had a smart TV, and I don't know why. Myself, I had a Samsung. This shit always used to connect and pair to the TV. Don't ask me why. So I guess I made a mistake and I, I, I switched the TV. I switched over to all I could hear there is like, what the hell? <laughs> and the worst part of what it is, it is since connecting RA phone in 10 seconds, then it just started loading. And you start the wide jump. All you see is a freaking. Y'all getting doggy, bro. Baby! <laughs> My mom couldn't come down and tell me already do it. It wasn't me. And the words of Shaggy, it wasn't me. Trying to turn this thing off. I hold the power button, I see the slider to turn the phone off. So I slide. Nothing. I slide again. And again. And again, and now I'm panicking because I'm at my very Christian grandma's house at 3 a.m. And there is a woman hitting Symphony 3 alto vibrato high notes out loud on my phone that I'm not even supposed to have. I have to think of something, and I have to think of it fast. So I decided to let the video finish and wait it out. I put like two pills on the phone, but yeah. pass, and it stops. I take off the pillows. And another video plays. Since when does the hub have autoplay? Better question, who has the stamina to watch it on autoplay? So I start frantically yeah. sliding the power slider on the screen, and after like 20 attempts, it finally slides. Oh no, not the power off slider. Man, one. The SOS emergency Call 91169 slider. A screen pops up saying it will call the cops in three seconds. Keep in mind, a girl is still getting her insights rearranged out loud still. I try to press the cancel button, but my screen isn't working. My phone is about to Takashi me, bro. The timer starts. Oh, no. Stop, come on. 911, what's the emergency? No, wait. Hello, 911, how may I take your order? Uh, uh hi, uh, I'm sorry, but my uh -huh. phone's still won't work. Hello? I can't hear you. Hey, no, I'm good, sorry, it's just my screen won't work. Can you, are you okay? Next Another deal. video plays on the phone. Wait, what is that? Is this some type of joke? Wait, how did you recognize the song? I can send the police to your place right now. Wait, no, you don't understand. Oh, Jerry, this dude's watching the hum. The what? Man, I swear these officers aren't turning these niggas into hashtags fast enough. Okay, okay, it didn't exactly happen like that, but I'm positive the guy knew what was playing out loud in the background and wasn't a fan. But I try to explain in between strokes that my phone screen stopped working out there. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas say he tried to explain it between the stroke. The muscle's like, you see, I was trying to play a video, and but my Bluetooth speaker. <laughs> That's how I was, bro. He trying to explain it so dear mid stroke. Compromising time, and that I accidentally called, and eventually he gets it and hangs up. And I guess since my phone had a call, it like fixed because when he hung up the phone. It started working again, Ooh. and I went right back to the video. That girl was going crazy. Back when I was in sixth grade middle school, I didn't know how to segue the topic. I was in PE, and my coach announced that we were going to play basketball and that he was going to separate us into multiple four-man teams for a tournament. This was because only half of the gym was available mm. because the drama club was, like, preparing for our play or, or something. So Fist the coach began separating us into groups, and I'm selected to join the yellow jersey team. When I put on that jersey, the looks on the faces of all the players on the yellow team lit up. They acted Man. as if LeBron himself put on the jersey or something. Why? Well, 
I was one of the very few black kids in the gym. And Damn. I was the tallest on they, the team. They thought you was a so, superstar. So after fitting their fingers for their championship rings, my teammates welcomed me to the team. We get to the court and face the red jersey team. Oh, my. One of my teammates hits it and passes it to me. Shocker. I see someone come from my right to try to block me. I get past them. I jump. I shoot. Money. All I did was a simple jump shot. It wasn't even a three. They thought he was Stephen Curry. Oh, yeah, I, oh. yeah. I might as well have crossed everyone on the team at the same time, waited at the goal for someone to block me, and then windmill under the leg, got, got front flip, dunked on one of my opponents. Like, that's in the face and everything. So the commotion my team was making, obviously, attracted other people to the gym. So everyone's watching this game. The other team has the they ball. They thought you was Down the court, they shoot. But miss, yeah, ball. rebound it, it gets passed to me. Shocker. I dribble, I jump, I shoot. The Man. ball goes right out the front oh, door, bro. The first shot was a fluke. They didn't realize that I suck at basketball, okay? I just have melanin and long legs. Damn. I'm not a baller, okay? I get the ball and walk back to ball the team. Looks like they're mad at me for not being good. Like, sorry. Nigga, that's, that's not fair. It shouldn't matter if you're Asian, Latino, white, not white. You should have yeah. the right to be tall and not good at basketball. Anyways, after my team realizes that I'm a disgrace to the black community, they just don't pass to me. The game goes on, and I'm not doing anything for a while. Ah, uh, you won my bench. This dude on the other team, and I always notice that he fakes and goes left every time. He has the ball, so I think this... This is my chance. I have to redeem myself. He runs up to me and I say with my eyes, you are not getting past me. And he says with his eyes, challenge accepted. Accept he runs up and fakes right as I predicted and then goes left as I predicted. I stick up my hand, lunge and grab nothing Miss. but fucking air. This nigga somehow <laughs> found a way to get to the other side of my body. I genuinely don't know how. I literally saw him on my left. There is no reason at all as to why a human being should be moving that fast. Like, bro, if you don't stop playing basketball and play for the Avengers, I stick out my left leg and try to oh my get God, my body the other way, and then ankle bro hits the ground. This nigga stole my ankles, yo. I'm on the ground and I see him make the shot, but before my brain can even process. Oh my gosh! He did not make the shot, yo. Please, oh my god. It's one thing for to break your ankle, but to finish off focus. Hey, bitch, don't blame me. But to finish off, don't don't get slapped. But to finish off strong, you can't get no holes in that school no more, man. You can't get no, you can't get no holes in that school, bro. They watch you drop to the ground and hold your ankles, bro. You some poor oh boy here. That'd be the worst. Honestly, I would rather they laugh at me than that. That was. <laughs> I get up, I dust myself off, and we proceed to lose the game. Let's just say you definitely will not see me play oh my YouTuber God, one that really one basketball game. Damn. Damn. Hey, what's up, blue demons? I feel like I'm Suko. I can draw four or five. I be playing Uno. First, I put a mask on. I'm a doom. I put a nigga's face in a box like a Zoom car. Feel like a Jeff Bay. Yeah, get any niggas pain. You know, test day. Yeah, be niggas the same. I be test day. Chop, chop, chop. I make a nigga say bye, bye, bye. Like I'm playing safe. Baby, go ahead and back in. I be me. Uh, she didn't send the signals trying to figure what they need. Uh, I want all the green. Uh, hey! Okay, bro, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm tired as a bitch, bro. I'm tired like a prostitute. Oh, gosh. But I'm gonna go take a nap, y'all. I hope you guys enjoy this, man. I've been doing. I, okay, I, oh, let me say, I've been, I wanted to apologize for not being as consistent as I would like to, bro. I have a second job now, so I'm trying to balance that out so I can pay the bills and get a little surprise. I know I promised you guys a surprise, but I'm still working on it. That's why I got a second job, so we can speed up the process, all right? So, get me a little t extra tired, then I have to work, you know, um, but I'm not going to stop making YouTube videos. I'm, n I'm not, I don't care. I'm not going to stop. If I got to just do one video once a day, like how I know y'all know, y'all know how I started with six, and five, and I go on to three 
if I could upload just one video every week, I'm gonna give you guys one video. But I'm I'm, I'm trying my best to upload every single day. I'm gonna upload something for sure. Don't matter if it's just one video. I'm gonna upload something. But just thank I just wanna say thank you to everybody who being patience and showing me support through this whole whole YouTube shit, man. I, I I'll be honest with you guys. I don't even know what I'm doing to be honest. All I know is when I press record, watch a video, talk shit. Not blue, to be honest with you guys. So I'm I'm learning as I go. Trust me, I'm learning as I go. But hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. If you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 100,000 subscribers. I know it's a fun number, but guess what? I still want to do. Give me 100,000. Give me 100. You too. Give me my 100,000. Listen, I can bite you, you know. I I can bite you. You play with me, but. That being said, I hope you guys have an awesome day, man. Be happy, be blessed, and remember, the world is yours. Peace and love.